Genovese. I'm the coordinator for Trout in the Classroom. As you all know, we ended school a little bit early this year or we're taking a really long break. So I went around to your schools and I collected your trout. Thank you so much for all these beautiful trout. They look so wonderful. I brought them up here from New York City to put here into the Cross River. And if you can see behind me, this is a really nice, healthy stream for the trout. They are going to love being here. You can see there's nice vegetation all around the stream. It'll be nice and cool in the summertime. And in a moment, we're actually going to take the temperature of the stream to make sure that we can acclimate our fish to the right temperature before we release them. Uh, I have some volunteers here, my little helpers. I've got Julie, wave hello. And Dominic, wave hello. These are my kids. And here's our little trout. We can't release him just yet. We are about to measure the stream temperature because we can't release the trout until they temperatures in these buckets are within three degrees of the stream temperature. So I have my helper here, Julie, measuring the stream temperature. All right, Julie, what are you using there to measure the temperature? Okay, well, can you hold it up and tell us the temperature? All right, that was great. Thanks, Julie. So 44.5 degrees Fahrenheit is what our stream temperature is right now. If we have to be within three degrees, I want you guys to think about what that range of temperatures might be that would be okay for these buckets to be before we can start doing the release. So if you said that the temperature should be between 41.5 degrees Fahrenheit and 47.5 degrees Fahrenheit, you are right. And in fact, we have measured the temperature in these buckets. And as you can see, what is that temperature there? 47.5 degrees Fahrenheit. Hey trout, welcome to the watershed. So I got these trout from the classrooms in New York City, from the Bronx and from Brooklyn and Queens. Here they are in Manhattan, Harlem. So thank you everyone for doing such a great job with these beautiful fish. Thank you to the teachers who took such good care of them. Look at that guy, he is so handsome. So I think they're gonna have a great time living here in New York City's watershed. They'll uh, be indicator species. They'll tell us that our water is so healthy and clean, best water in the world. 